Hi, I'm Tam. I'm gonna show you how to make a long necklace with mala prayer beads on blue cord. So basically, um, we're gonna make something like this, which this is a sample of a necklace that I made already. Basically, this is something really long that you can wear doubled as a necklace or wrap around your wrist multiple times. This is another uh, fun fiber that I like to use. It's called uh, rat tail and it's made um, from rayon. And these come in tons of great bright colors. So if that's sort of the look you're going for, this would be the material for you. So I'm gonna use these mala prayer beads and they are traditionally like 108 beads on a strand and they look like this normally. And I've already cut some open and I'm just gonna show you how to make this necklace. So I'm not gonna be able to get this through the bead, so I'm going to make a needle out of um, any kind of wire. So you wanna take about three inches, um, make a needle like so. And then you're going to wrap the wire so that they don't, it doesn't open and that's basically what a needle looks like. And then that makes the whole stringing process. So the first one is always gonna be a little stiff, the thick doubled fiber here. So you wanna just put, pull using your pliers. So that's it, the next. Um... So you wanna allow enough string. I didn't measure this. Um, beforehand because um, I just kept it on a long piece. But this necklace is about 44 inches. And then basically we just knot it at the end, so it's very, um, it's very simple. It's nothing complicated. So these are all the beads I'm gonna use. And then I want to measure the cord. So this necklace is 44 inches, so that means I have to do 88 inches doubled. So here's 22, so here's 44. So then I'm gonna double this. But I'm gonna allow some extra yardage for the knotting process. So on this necklace that I have made previously, it has not that many pearls on it, it's just all about the knots, whereas this one, I have more, more of the beads. So basically I'm just gonna knot one end so that they don't fall off. And this color, the wood color looks really great with the blue. I wanna have the same sort of effect, so I don't wanna put bunch of them all together. Um, then you could also um, just throw in some decorative knots and also, um, you know, make some knots thicker by doubling it like so, so you're making two knots over the same one. Just then it gives you a sort of high-low effect with like a smaller knot and a double knot. And then I'm gonna work um, also from the other end so that it's not, so it doesn't look uneven. So I'm just gonna knot this end as well. These are sort of easy projects that you don't have to like stress about measuring every like two seconds. and being super precise about everything. So here I'm gonna do that. So these, um, this, this rat tail it's called, it comes in lots of really, really great colors and um, you could also double the cord, so meaning 
take two colors and put them together and then do the knotting around the bead. These would also work well with like, you know, if you have some really beautiful um, glass beads like from Murano or something, which is the glass capital of Italy. Um, and they've been doing glass since ancient forever. Always just shoot some glue if you, um, before you cut the string to prevent it from fraying. So basically that's it. And then you could wear it um, around your wrist.